Hello everybody, this is Arathus and welcome back to RimWorld 40k Season 2. So, I got quite a few good tips at the end of the last episode that I'm going to take, well, in the comments after the last episode, that I'm going to take advantage of. One of which, uh, I had no idea that this worked this way because I just barely got the mending mod and I didn't do a lot of research into it, but apparently, if you mend clothing that you take from corpses, it removes the dead man debuff, which means I can sell that shit for a fair amount of money. So that's what we're going to be doing now. Additionally, somebody told me about the very awesome, um, this button right here. I've been overlooking it the whole time, or maybe it was just added with the last patch. I don't know. But apparently if I click on this, the home zone will not automatically expand just because I built something. And that is, frankly, fantastic because I have been hating, hating the fact that my home zone has automatically expanded and allows my people to basically wander outside my walls when I have them confined to just home if I keep that front door unlocked. So this will remove that. The home, once you click on that, and like I said, I had no idea, the home zone only expands when you tell it to expand. So there we go. Uh, additionally, I'm also thinking about starting up another colony because uh, raw resources are not something that we are doing well at finding in this episode. It sucks, but it's true. There's not a damn thing I can do about it. So, first of all, I'm going to do this. I'm going to make medicine. I know it uses steel, but I have plenty of steel and textiles. However, I do not, under any circumstances, want my devil strand used on this. Only everything else. Okay, I don't mind them using steel, because we are, we are doing better on steel. And I'd like 250 normal medicine. That's only 500 steel. Huh. Okay. So now with that done, we're going to focus on our mining. And one of the things I'm planning on doing with this area is once I remove all the roofs and shit, is I am going to tell my people to, move, to build my power generation and core drills over here where they're safer and out of the damn way. Okay. So with that, let's dive right back in. Also, I have not played at all since the last um, episode, so you guys haven't missed anything, and I also have not... Um, I also have not downloaded any new mods, so... Now, the reason I put the home zone back here, even though I normally don't, is now that I've got that, lack, that no friendly fire mod, I'm not worried about our people shooting each other in the firing range anymore, or shooting one of the animals. Now, I believe I have a fair amount of cloth, and I believe I also killed the... Yeah. Shit, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to create another growing zone for... Devil Strand. And I'm going to come over here to the clothing section... Let's select all the halfway finished clothing, cancel it, bills, the details, clear all. We're going to switch everything, all of our clothing for our colonists to only use Devil Strand. This way everybody feels like they're wearing a nice, um, high quality, tough piece of clothing. None of this... Um, cloth and stuff they'll they'll enjoy it <laughs> clear all devil strand okay and hopefully also if we keep making devil strand clothing that shit will sell for a lot of money and i can work on my economy with that devil strand is an easy has always been a reliable and easy way for me to make money in this game once i have my grow zone set up to grow year round because people pay out the, like, the merchants pay out the ass for anything made out of Devil Strand. So, I'm gonna do that. Meteorite. Jade. I'll be damned. That's not bad. 
Okay, we already said you guys can do... Um, yep. Allow sewing, Devil Strand. Excellent, excellent. Oh, that was the other tip I was given. I'm going to give it a shot. I've never done this before, but I make it so everybody can do... is going to be priority one cleaning. Because apparently they won't need to clean constantly and they'll still have time for their normal jobs. It's a, it's a tip I was given in the comments. We'll see how it works. I do not have 76 toques, but I might need to make 76 toques for 8,000 silver. Asia? Where's Asia? This might actually be worth, um, uh, worth investigating. Because it won't take me long to make 79 damn toques. This is a seal. Where am I? Peace talks. That's wow. You're right behind, right beside a tyrannid place. That's not good. Uh, am I just? Oh no, we're right here. Okay, that is actually not very far. Hmm. But you have a Hive Fleet location right next to it. I don't know about this, dude. Area revealed. Uh-oh. Oh, that's it? Okay, I don't give a shit. Hey! Keep getting me that uh, steel. You're going past the line, but... I think you're going past the line, aren't you? Nope, you're right at the line. But now you're going to go past the line because there's more steel and I can't turn down steel at the moment. I think to keep my people focused on the top there. Well, fuck. Okay. I'm going to cancel this mining down here for now. Well, if we have this shit going on, I need more beds. And thankfully, I already have the hospital built. So, Ryder and Cummings, you're our two best builders. Please, 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 please make me some hospital beds. We have real medicine. I don't think we have the materials to make actual. Let's cancel this, actually. Can I make Imperial Hospital beds? I actually can. Not a lot. Oh, shit. Whew, okay. I was going to be like, I can't afford to do it out of Ceramite. What do we think? One... Two hospital beds per room. That seems fair, right? Whoa. No. No, no, no. Oh, shit. Even out of steel. It still takes ceramite. Ouch. Nope. Normal hospital bed. I think I'll do that, and I'll replace it later with a steel, I mean with a, with a imperial hospital bed. And I know I don't have enough medicine to build all of these, but I can build a couple of them. And somebody's making us medicine, so. Sacriel has named Capybara one novella. Somebody needs to finish these beds. We have sick and potentially dying people everywhere. Can you please finish that? Like, seriously, just stop fucking around. Come make me this shit for the love of God. Uh, need more resources, okay. We don't have enough medicine to finish that one. We only have one. But it works. I know I could technically f cram a lot more hospital beds in there, but I don't want to have people getting bitchy at me because it's too cramped in there. Let's remove all this. Our people can come get treatment as needed. Just go lay in the hospital beds, dude. Two. This uses, I believe, the tailoring skill to create um, 
God damn, your stats are insane. Holy shit. So it's the crafting skill, I guess. Okay. And we are actively trying to recruit this dude, right? We're not just giving him shit and... Yeah. He's not just draining our resources for no reason, right? Hey, Bite. Um, can you... I mean, I appreciate the hospital bed thing, but can you... Go get, go get treated. Because apparently you need to be treated right the hell now. Excellent. Okay, cargo pods. Where did they land? What was in them? Meh. Meh. Man, I kind of want to come over here and hunt, though. Jesus. Oh, another thing I wanted to do. I learned very quickly recently that... Simple meals are just not worth it compared to... Well, they are worth it in terms of what you have to put in them, but they are not worth it compared to... Like, they don't give you a buff, right? But apparently, stir-fried meals and stews give, like, a well-fed bonus. And let's see here. Watch. Uh, let's go to uh, stir-fried, right? It improves their manipulation and blood filtration. And I believe the stew does even more. Consciousness, metabolism, blood filtration, blood pumping. That is all some fantastic shit, honestly. And I need to remove these real quick. Broodlord, Exocrine, Gene Stealer, and then there's Moloch and I believe Tyrannocyte. It'd be nice if there was just a um, option for just Tyranid. Like, just no Tyranid or no alien flesh, honestly. I'd be okay with that. I don't see a button that says that, though, so we're just gonna have to go through this. Like this. Moloch and Tyranocyte. Thank you. I believe you are already creating stew down here. So I think I would just need to add... Uh, what is it? Stir fry. Because I do like the idea of all those extra, of my food actually having some benefits beyond simply, oh yeah, you're not starving to death now. So, there we go. Get to it, guys. Make me better food. And I know this stuff may not be as efficient. What the fuck? I've been removing... No, apparently I'm not. No, 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 no. Zone. Remove roof. Remove... Oh, yeah. Remove the roof from this area, please. Apparently I didn't do that over here either. Shit. Yeah, remove the roof from those areas, please. Hey, look at that. We found components. We are not exactly short on components. I don't like that. We've struck compacted. Ooh, ceramite. I, how did I not see the ceramite a second ago when I looked up here? I saw components, didn't see the ceramite, which I kind of need more ceramite than components. Okay. Dude, we have hospital beds. Just... Go use them if you need treatment. Jesus. I'm not going to replace this with dual hospital beds yet because we just don't have... There's no real need for it. I'm just going to hold off until... Ooh, Rogue Trader. Uh, who is our best negotiator? It's not you. Well, you're certainly one of them. Ryder, the Imperial Assassin. Don't kill them, just talk to them. She has the flu, though. Yeah, and see right there? Eight stew, well fed. Okay. I kind of want to buy some medicine so I can build that hospital bed. Imperial components. I know I need that for a couple of things. Chain sword is just something I just want. <laughs> uh-huh. Okay. 
You have some nice stuff, and I really, really, really want my people to start using Lasgun. Thunder hammers? Really? <laughs> Damn it. Oh, God, you're making this so difficult, guys. Uh. Eh. I can't. I, I can't. I'm going to buy up all your normal medicine, as expensive as it is, so I can build this new hospital bed. <sighs> I want all that stuff so very badly. Okay, we have people lacking ranged weapons. Let's look. Okay. How about you come pick up an assault rifle? You're already armed. Black, you're armed. Bite. You have zero shooting skill, so I'm not going to give you a fucking gun. Zachriel. Sniper, because I know you have shooting skill. You're just not a primary shooter. And I don't think I have any brawlers hanging about. Hmm. Let's let everybody come and take their new guns. Okay. You come pick this up, Mila. Bite. I believe you're the one with zero. Yep. So you be our four sword user, please. And I like that there's more steel right here. That'll help. Ooh, I see adamantite. I want adamantite. <laughs> Let's do a little bit of this explore. I know this is not the most efficient way to do it. I just really don't mind right now. And I know I'm going well past the line, but I can always fortify that northern strip in case something does decide to spawn if I mine all the way to the edges. Okay. How is everything going? Let's look at this. Mend simple apparel. Oh shit. I should probably just leave this open, right? And then, I think I'm gonna keep that to good to legendary. Why do we wanna keep around shitty clothing? Cause it would sell better actually, let's be honest. All right, so we can get some more money out of it. So let's leave it at fix everything. Also doesn't seem to take, like, an extremely long time. And let's see. I already switched all of our clothing, I believe, to only use Devil Strand. Yes. Ooh, Pirate Merchant, I want to talk to you. Cummings. Shit. Oh, it's Ryder, anyway, who's better at this. Apparently, I can just sell him off to be a slave. I am not going to do that, because I am not an asshole. To be fair, that could very easily change in the future. Yeah, no, buy all this. Take all that shit off of me. I don't need it. <clears throat> now, I do have a fair amount of plasteel. It's not enough to build a core drill, but what I did notice earlier, I may not have commented on it, is that I do have enough everything else to make a gun complex and frankly I kind of want to and since there's a door right here this would not be exposing my base I kind of want a stronger gun complex uh, fortification because the Tyranid in particular seem to really like coming after me from this angle. And I frankly am sick of it. Are you kidding me? <laughs> you sons of bitches. Oh. Well, we need to hold this line. Hopefully... They are not actually going to be able to reach us simply due to the hail of ungodly firepower that is going to come down upon their heads. Firepower that I am going to be 
more than happy to use on these tribal assholes who decided to attack me at this point in time when my base is exposed, you sons of bitches. Now you don't need to be. Everybody. Also, bears. Bears. No. No. No, no. No, no. Get the fuck up out of here. Yeah, since this is the angle they're they're at, they're gonna come straight up the straight through the bottom. Cheta shit. Undraft go go rest. Beginning their assault. I'm waiting for you. I see that you're using that for cover down there. Man, we have put so many of you dudes down. Flee! Go for it! You are running in the absolute wrong, 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 wrong direction. Just chit, making sure everybody who's hurt is not in immediate danger. Cool. Go do your thing. Do we want to capture any of you guys? Psychopath. No, thank you. Psychopath. No, thank you. Jealous and hypersensitive. But you're a good warrior. Damn it. I could, I could take you. Dumb labor, you can't do it. Careful shooter. I think you're the one I'm going to take. Yep, Seo. Did we ever look at Hornet, though? Beautiful, fast walker, careful shooter, social is the only thing she can't do. Okay, we want Hornet and Seo. Uh, Hornet and Sayo, if you do not... Well, I guess I don't need two of those, because I'm only taking Hornet and Sayo. So one bed will do it. Capture Hornet. Capture Sayo. Everybody else can go fuck themselves. It's messed up to say, but that's how it's going to be. Let us unforbid the weapons. Because I can sell this shit. I'm going to strip. Strip. Time to use these as um, the resources they are meant to be. Yeah, strip them all. All the bodies. And I'm going to unforbid the door. And I'm going to build. Just because I'm going to continue building our big ass grave site. Like I said, if nothing else, to, in my head, this kind of also serves as a warning. It's like, look at how many fuckers I've killed. Do you really want to attack us? Go. Who has a severe illness? Hornet? Yeah, no. I'm bandaging you up right now. You'll be fine. Chat and recruit. Chat and recruit. It's going to take a while, but you'll join me. You'll come around. I'm going to need a bigger storeroom, so for now, 
Rolf has gotten sick. What the f... Oh, we never... Oh, I guess we use the medicine on everything else, or we just haven't bothered. Come over here and fix this. Yo, Rolf. We, a lot of people need treatment. Let's get to the... Where the fuck are you? Yeah, I'm not doing anything to save these people. Strip. Okay. I need to create a zone, though. Just for now. Stockpile zone. Clothing. Like we're going to copy these settings. We're going to paste them here. And we are going to build another one of these dead center. Get to it. And our battery... Oh, the Eclipse. That's why our batteries are empty. <sighs> Starvation. Go feed yourself, Bite. Lumi, what the hell? You're sick and hungry. Okay. Fix it. No. No. Rescue her, she'll join you. Incapacitated. She's gonna have to die. I am busy. We are not doing so hot right now. Like we have a couple people that may not... That may not make it through this. At least everybody's treated now. Oh, there was something I wanted to do with the medicine. Okay, good. I already... I couldn't remember if I actually removed the whole, you know, devil strand as an option. All right, let's come over here. Let's remove roof area. Here. And here. And here. Okay. Now that we have this built, we can haul this. Everybody died. Yeah, you can eat the corpses. I don't give a shit. Hey, Cummings. You wanna... I really need to plug that gap. And we can build a gun complex now. Man, I don't want it to be a... I'm gonna go with a steel gun complex. Holy shit. That is some nice range. Yeah, we're going to go with the steel gun complex because I do not have enough ceramite to spare. Cummings? Not hauling. Work on the fortified gun complex. We'll turn it into ceramite later. For now, I don't give a shit. I just want more firepower. Okay. What the hell is that? Ambrosia. Yeah, I don't give a shit about the Ambrosia. Hey, you can strip this person, though. About good here? Okay. Shog. Uh, Hall. 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 Just gonna give him a series of orders to come haul as much as he can. This is gonna look like a weird little pattern for him. But this is some good shit for us. This is good trade goods, man. Oh, you're 
hunting a snow hare, are you? Fucking lynx. Made me very nervous. Okay, take all that out. You make me nervous, wolf. Okay. Shog is carrying everything I need him to carry. Cummings, what are you doing? I'd really like this gun complex to be done, though. You know how awesome that would be? Yeah, that's what you get, you asshole. You tried to hunt me. Hey, Cummings. Nah, 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 nah. You ain't rescuing shit. Who is starving and why? Shaw. Oh. Sorry, Shog. Hey, McCoy! This can now be a medical room without being a prisoner room. Good, because we probably should have done that. We, sh we needed that. Thank you, McCoy. Keep clearing some shit out for us. I'd really like this gun complex as well. You know, if you could be bothered to build it for me. Hell yeah. That's pointed the wrong ass way. Let's see how it works, though. Because I put it with the manning station over here. Like, I don't like that the gun is pointed at me. I feel like I put that in backwards. I do feel like that's backwards. Yeah, I feel like that's the way it should be, though. We'll have to see when a target comes along. Hmm. I feel like a lot of our other work isn't getting done. That's a big-ass adamantite deposit, it looks like. That's good. Hmm. That was a mistake. That was a big mistake. We might lose Cheetah because I made that dumbass mistake. Yeah, that was a that was a that was a miscalculation. Rescue Cheeta, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> oh, that was a dumb move on my part. I should have waited for the wolf to come down here and then target him down here. But hey, at least this is plugged, even if that does not look like it's facing the right direction. Okay, I think the colony's finally clean. That's why our people are doing all this. Okay. I think they just had a lot of cleaning work to do before they could do other tasks. That's why they haven't been, like, hauling and shit. Somebody has the hunt order, though, right? Well, apparently the lynx is going to make himself, like, it's going to feed him herself, I should say. <laughs> yeah, no, people are, animals are killing each other. Uh, you're gonna possibly get infected. Ah, beautiful Aurora. 
And a warg has come to feed. Yeah, let's get these corpses out of here. And I'm actually going to go to settings. Like, can I put blight drones in here? No, I most definitely cannot. Because we have a couple blight drone corpses and I can't get rid of them. <laughs> Uh-uh. You, mother... You. Come here. This fucking wolf. This wolf just tried to eat us. Uh, we're gonna wait till Cheda is back in the camp. And then I'm gonna kill this asshole. Nah. No, 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 no. That is not the order I want you to follow. There we go. Predators. Nope, I'm not going to try. I've tried a couple times to coexist with the predators. And they always try to eat me. They die on sight now. Pirate merchant, don't need you. I cannot get over how weird it looks that the gun is facing that way. But I'm pretty sure if I flipped it around, our people would stand on the other side. And it would just be stupid looking. Now you'd be even... Well, it wouldn't be stupid looking, but it would be worse because I wouldn't be able to man it from inside my base. Oh really? That's all it took? So the gun always faces up. Yep, okay. Never mind. It doesn't matter. Flip it around. Thank you. Okay. It always looks the same. That's all I needed to check. Uh-huh. Oh, you guys finally hauling this shit? Thank you. This is all very useful shit that I could use. Let me haul. How much medicine? Not enough. Oh, hey, you guys are not... You guys are not sick anymore, so this is just a prisoner room. Cargo pods. Show me. Biofuel, okay. Area revealed, what the hell? Oh, that's what I was kind of hoping would not happen. Well, remove roof from all of these areas. And I am, ooh, there is some of that though. Okay. Uh, we have Ceramite. So... That might be what we have to do here. And we're not building an auto door. I looked into it just in case you guys are wondering why I'm not doing an auto door. Um, Imperial, like adamantite auto doors don't open any faster than um, standard. Like they don't open any faster than, uh, sorry, uh, adamantite auto doors, Jesus. Have a 300% O-door opening speed just like a normal one. So why bother using... So honestly, as far as I'm concerned, why bother using the electricity and the materials if it does not go any faster? Shaw, it's time to... It's time to have you do this again. Real quick, come on. All the way up. And if anybody wants to help you in the hauling, that's fine. But I want this hauled now. Apparently somebody does, Cheta. I wish all these solar flares and shit and eclipses and shit would fucking stop. <laughs> This is irritating in the extreme. 
yeah, we'll put these walls up here and see how it goes from there. We're probably going to have to wall all the way around because I do want all this shit gone at some point. Come on, guys. Do the thing. Shog is probably going to get pissed off any minute now. All of our crops because that that fucking solar thing lasted just long enough to kill all of our kill a huge chunk of our crops. Oh, you fucking asshole! You know, I think I'm gonna come over here, and I think I'm gonna take like half our people off of cleaning, like entirely. And the other half can stay on one cleaning. And we'll see how that works for me. More balanced. I don't think we need everybody on cleaning. Major break risk. Shog, because he has not finished. Let's clear pr your prioritized work. Go get some sleep. People will haul the remainder of this without you. Yeah, quite effectively, actually. I just don't want any of the animals to follow our people outside of camp. Hmm. Come on. I just want all this inside our camp. So that's all shit that we're going to be able to use quite nicely, as a matter of fact. All that shit gets repaired, all that shit we can trade. Thank you for planting new crops, my friend. Mm -hmm. How much medicine do we... We have a lot of medicine. <laughs> Come on. I want all this picked up so we can actually, you know, make some progress towards having some decent money and some steel. And I need this money. I need to be able to buy. Because I have not found any plasteel yet. This is ridiculous. Plasteel is amazing. Give me plasteel. Okay. Well, we did find three deposits that I... Fuck. Hey, Barga. Can you... Mine some limestone? No, no, no. You can finish that and go to an actual bedroom. Good God, dude. <laughs> Okay, so I think this is a good place to stop for now, uh, as seeing as we finally found some adamantite, some ceramite, promethium, which we don't need quite yet, but we're getting there, and a fairly decent number of steel deposits. So we can build a core drill as soon as I can get my hands on some plasteel. We're just not having any luck with an appropriate trader for plasteel. We need a bulk goods trader, I do believe. But once that arrives, we can build our first core drill and use it to bring up all kinds of shit. So, but for now, like I said, we are all out of time for today. So thank you everybody so very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video at all, then please, by all means, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, or any combination of those actions that suits you today. And with that, I'll see you next time for some more RimWorld 40K Season 2, where we will hopefully get these damn core drills, because holy crap, it's taking forever. Uh, thanks again for watching, guys.